Hello. Let's see. There we go. Now we got audio. Alright, so there's an Alpha Raptor down here. We're going to go down here and try and kill it. Uh, we can it with one of the Lightning Waverns back at the castle. So hopefully we can get the last hit. Try and get some more levels on this guy. And there is a 210 White Rex up there by the castle that I'm going to try and knock out here in a minute. while we're doing this let's go ahead and ah shit I took off all the narcotics I'll have to do that a little, little bit a little bit that raptor I'll say this thing should be pretty bloody oh no don't go in the water Running into me. I don't think it can hit me. Come on. Die. Give me those oh sweet levels. Thing's got to be about dead. Come on. <laughs> I'm about to land here in a minute. Jeez. Die. Thank goodness the Quetzal attack has a hit back. My goodness, this thing is tanky. to be about dead. Alright, oh, that's fine. Let me get my stamina back. I'm only pissed if that stupid turtle kills it, though. Oh, shit. 
No, 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 no. Follow me, follow me, follow me. Terrible disaster. Oh my goodness. Can you just die already? <laughs> it's ridiculous this thing is taking this long to kill. Stupid deal up sore. Seriously. This thing's pissing me off. your ass back here. underneath me.
God, this thing's gotta be about dead. Seriously. Can I kill this Alpha Raptor now? <laughs> this is ridiculous.
finally killed it. Thank goodness. What's up, Drex? What do we get from it? Oh, we got absolute crap. That's what we got from it. At least we got eight levels. I didn't forget what the hell we were doing. Okay. We were going to farm up some metal for a metal behemoth gate for our little cave. So we're going to take the Anki out farm up like 2,000 ingots so that's a good amount of metal so it may be a little bit of boring boringness for a little bit but we'll get to it after I get that gate made up um, we're gonna go after a titanosaur and kill it with a lightning wavering and then we'll we may come back and knock out this 210 Rex that's over here and tame it up so I think it's male I'll have to look at it again, but if it's a male, then it'll go really nicely with my female. Uh, I have a 20, I tamed a 203 black and, well, actually, it's red and grayish uh, female Rex. It's over there in my pen, along with my two Tyrannosaurus. So, we'll see what we get into. We'll tame some stuff. See if that Rex is still over here. It's over here somewhere. It was a white one. I don't know if it's been wandered around somewhere. Or what? Wait, what was inside there? They didn't get inside the pen? I hope not, because the Gigas will kill it then. I think I just saw it inside the pen. What the hell? There's already another Alpha Raptor down there? Oh boy. That's not the Rex, that's a 77 female. You know, I'm just gonna kill it on the, uh... We're just going to... Actually, chill, chill out, Jade. going to use him. Light everybody up. Off a go. Where did the alpha raptor go? That's a berry. Well, that was a berry. Ooh, boy, it's a 203. Wow, that's a high level, nice berry. I don't know where the alpha raptor went, though. Oh, there it is. Yeah, shit, figures it's in there. I don't want to kill the berry. Where did it go?
window. You know what? I'm gonna kill it with the quetzal too. Hopefully it wouldn't take as long. Jeez, that took forever. Why not? Got it. Uh oh, I got some good stuff, looks like. Let's go up here and see what we just got. What did we get? Okay, I'll take that. I don't want that. Don't want that, don't want that. Would have been nice thought I got another Mastercraft. Crossbow. But, let's see, apprentice, apprentice, and then that, don't want that. Eh, I mean, this we got a journeyman pick, or a hatchet. Not too shabby, I guess. Got some more levels. I'll run up here and repair real quick, and then we'll get the metal farming. And we got too much shit around here now. Or they do, rather. this. That's okay for now. Is there a blueprint? Do we have anything for gloves yet? No. Go and craft up one of these. back. Where'd that helmet go? There we go. I forgot I need to do this. Where's my gloves? Glove, 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 gloves. Where'd they go? Deal. We can repair them too. Get rid of that, that, get rid of that. To come back. Put them on. Is there any metal in here already? Nope. Okay. Alright, we should be good to go for a little bit. Let's go farm some metal. I definitely need to make that behemoth gateway for now. Oh. Yeah, what's up, Viper? I'm not going to take all your metal, though. There's, I need 2,000 something ingots for it. I'm going to farm some for a little bit, dude. I'm not just going to take it all, get some at least. We have 9,000? Good grief. I'll farm up some still, though. I just feel better about it. At least because I had that one... Uh, I'd farmed up 1,000 before the, that one the other day. So I'll go ahead and just farm up another 1,000 or so just to have that. Plus, I need some for the gate, so... Oh, 
What was it? Chess piece? What is it? What quality? By the way, there's that 203 Baryonyx down there. German? Okay, I'll look at it here in a little bit. Um, by the way, the Quetzal Anki thing, you can still do it. You have to use a ramp, though, for the uh, on the Quetzal platform saddle. If you have a ramp, you can still do that. Sweet, here's a rich one. Do I already have a bunch of shit on me? Yep. Yeah. Get rid of that. I'll go up to the uh, the winter area here too in a little bit and check that drop or that little treasure chest. See if there's anything good from it. It'd be awesome if I got an actual Quetzal slat or platform saddle. All right, man. Good night. Level Sicarno. Not that I need one. Two o three. Dang, that's a high level one too. So many high level things here on Ragnarok. Drop it right there. There's a raptor. I don't feel like fooling with it. I probably should just take the damn thing over to the metal cave, really. Let's do that. Probably more well worth it. If you don't know where the metal cave is, I'll show you. It's a good little journey, but hey, it's worth it. There's our two gigas down there. I wish there were some better metal spawns up here around here. Let's go ahead and grab these. Let's drop the stone. Actually, I may not need to go that far. Chill out, chill out, chill out. Let's see if we can grab that. All this metal. Back it up. How much we got? We got almost a thousand metal already. No, oh, shoot, 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 shoot.
That could have been a lot worse. Should be a couple more little metal spots. Hope we can finish off getting our thousand metal. Maybe, yes. There's a node right there, but it's a weak one. Oh well, screw it. I don't need that much, so. Get out of the way. Pop. And we're good. Get him. Alright, let's go back. Apparently Viper has like 9,000 freaking metal. It's so good. We can make that real quick and then we can get to the juicy stuff. mind getting that baryonyx but we need kibble for it unless you have the kibble and you use fish meat it's a waste let's pull the resources Resources, metal. I got that. Okay. No one needs metal. Selected. Not enough resources. Are you kidding me? Damn it. So I'll have to use this one over here. Not enough. What am I missing? Polymer, I bet. And uh, I need crystal. Shit. Alright. Let's run over here and grab. You're in a shitty, shitty area, Mr. Dragon. over and trying to grab this yellow drop and then we'll go get the treasure from the the ice world or ice area watch this thing disappear right when I get to it you use the spyglass so that way you can see the health of the drop whenever it pops up it'll show you how much time it's got left it'll I'll say like 30 or 100 or whatever. And usually, okay, 20, so I got enough time to get there. As long as nothing nasty is around it, then I can just swoop in and get it. Okay, we should be good. What do you got for me? Apprentice Megalith Sword. I'll take that. Pre made. I don't have a Megalosaurus right now, but I actually think I have a better saddle for one. I'm not, I don't remember, but still. It's better than the primitive. Oh, 
we'll nab this little treasure chest right here. And if you've never known about this, then yeah, there's a little treasure chest right here. You have to be level 80 though to get it. What do you got for me? I'll take that. I know we don't have a frog either, but hey, an ascendant frog saddle, I'll take that all day long. Well, not all day long, but I don't want 30 freaking bullfrog saddles. I have a lot of meat. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna run over here to our little area, and I'm gonna drop off these uh, the saddles over here in my little pen area, and I'm going to feed our Tyrannosaurus and our two Eutyrannus. Here's our babies. I probably need to make a trough for them, but I'll do that later. Let's drop these like a so. What did I put on here already? Yeah, I got that. Just looking at what all I had in here. Metal gateway. hungry. Get all this raw meat off, off of it and feed it to y'all. Yeah, I know y'all gotta be hungry. I got levels. You have none. You have some. Let's give you some more health. Does my Rex have any? Nope. She's 318. She was 203 when I found her. Get out of there. Oh, that was a stupid cripple. We're making up 28. See what's in this purple jump. I feel like I have ADD, like I just get distracted. <laughs> like, ooh, drop. But hey, man, you never know what could be in there. I feel like it's always worth checking out, at least. Especially in like an area right here, like right here, where nothing can get you. It's like, hey, why not? What we got? Yeah. Oh well. Can't win them all. I can't get water from here, really? What the? Seriously? Weird. That's lame. Let's see. What are we going to do? We need to go find some crystal. And polymer. So let's go ahead and go over here to the volcano area. And kill some manta for the polymer. And then we can come back and find crystal. Probably have to go in the ice cave to get the crystal. Yeah, and I might be able to go up here. How much weight do I have on my griffin? Not a lot. But I only need like 200. Well, yeah, I only need couple hundred crystal. Some aloes. What level are you? I'm 33. It's a waste. I could never find like a black aloe. All this obsidian. Or you, Mr. Mantis. 28. You're dying. Now, I know, I, was gonna say, I know usually there's another Mantis right there by it. That's a 133. Don't really feel like messing with it. What level are you? 
140, and a 35. And see, there's a ton, there's quite a bit of crystal right there. Oh yeah, look at all that polymer. Oh shit, rock golem. Okay. Yeah, that's a crap ton of polymer. Let's take this back and then we'll come back and farm this crystal. Hello, Green, er, Jim. Good morning, I guess, for you. Or good afternoon. I don't know what time it is there. Oh, I need to land and get some freaking stamina. What time is it there? Nine. Okay. It's two here. You off to work? No, it's Saturday. Do you have to work today? By the way, Viper says he's sorry that he missed your request to play uh, whatever the game is y'all been playing. Killing Floor 2. Weekend party. You streaming later on today? Oh, there's Viper. He hasn't fixed it totally. <laughs> what? What'd you do to break it? Are you the man of the house? forget that these S plus things can still pull the polymer. Organic, organic, there we go. Why do you have egg polymer in your egg, or in your shit there? I'll pull it. Okay, I need to go get some crystal. Crystal. Taking a item shit right there in your castle there, buddy. Nope, I gotta get some. I'm just gonna go over to the uh, the volcano area. There's a crap down of crystal there. Get off. Nope, I don't have either one. Money's tight right now since we're building a house. Killing floor two looks pretty fun though. have crystal there you only had like 300 I think it needs like 500 crystal for the, the actual gate the glass gate so I'm just gonna run over here and get some it ain't no big deal there's tons of it over here in the volcano yeah but that cave's pretty sketchy I think from what you said but but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to play anything today anyways I don't know what's going on. We talked about going to dinner and seeing the movie and hanging out with the family, so I don't know. Sunday, of course, I gotta work. Okay, 
Where was all that crystal I just found a minute ago? It's over here somewhere. Here we go. Is there anything nasty nearby? Nope. Alright, let's go. Probably should have brought the Anki over here, but oh well. Actually, what's better for crystal? I don't remember. The, the Dodek or the, the Anki? should do is bring it over here but you know oh well I'm like full on with it as long as the volcano didn't go active right now that'd be terrible there, land right there Hit 91 so far That's fine, I just need like 200 more, so, ain't no big deal. Land. I don't have shorts on. Girl, I look fabulous. What are you talking about? Look at that. Got my wavering skin gloves on. Haven't you heard? Pink's pink is in. Mr. 196. Hey, I ain't afraid to rock some pink. See, the pink is what it's what distracts you and then the rest of the rest of my ninjiness is like hell yeah with the exposed chest and everything it just invites you in and then the next thing you know you're dead what are you doing oh, you stupid ass griffin thank you for doing what I told you to do Pure white Rex. I've never seen a pure white Rex. I mean, like the back and everything is white. I've always seen them with like they have the red or the black ridge. And if that thing was 210, that'd be freaking sweet. That's a pure albino. No, there's a white one with a red back by the um, by the castle. It's 210. What level is this aloe? 133. Where's your buddies at? You bastards always have buddies. There's one of your buddies. Oh, you tamed him.
to what you have a pure white one like that one I just saw. All right, good night, man. back and make our gate so we can go put the gate up by our little cave area we can get on our lightning waver and go hunt down that titanosaur and smack it into oblivion get that oh so sweet sweet xp from it to go over and look at his Rex as he was saying it stand. If he has a, a male all white all down on me, I'll breed it with my female that I have. Is he yellow over there? I don't feel like going to get it right now though. I don't see no damn white Rex. Well, we could always name them and name them after the Daedra. Wait, what am I doing? I need to... Shit, I need to take it up there. What do you mean you made such a mess? Made such a mess on what? Ark or are you talking about something else? Okay, let's go back to our base. What the hell? First, let's run down here and get this yellow job. Seventy-seven. That's it. Wow. Here's some more aloes right here. Now, granted, I have enough aloes really at back at base, and I have four incubated eggs. But hey, it's a 196. That must be the, the high level one. It's ugly. They're always green. Like I can't never find like a black male. Yeah, there's dinos all over the place. He's going to have to move them over there to the little ship thing he's building. There's way too much crap over there now at the castle. It's like y'all are, are hoarding dinos, but it doesn't help or hurt. Or I guess help, rather. Nope, don't want to. Um, that so many other people are hatching shit there and raising stuff. Right, there's like three different waverns right now being raised. So, I mean, you got, like, just waverings everywhere being raised and growing up. And then you got all the Rexes, all the freaking Quetzals and shit there now. Cave starting to get a little bit crowded too, so I think I finally found my spot though. But I gotta wait for 
S plus to get fixed. So it's so screwed up right now. Are you going to clear him out? I hear you. Well, I think I found my spot. It's a nice little scenic spot over in the redwoods, looking over the lake. A couple of flat areas right there I can chain together. I can put my flyers up on this uh, this pillar that splits the creek. I can make a bridge to it, and they'll be safe. There's nothing that's going to get them. No, S plus is broke right now since the last update. Um, the collision aspect of it where it, it clips through stuff it's not working you can't just put them anywhere anymore um, it's really screwed up right now and we're scared that if we put anything else right now there has been reports of some of the S plus stuff um, like if it gets fixed it eliminates all other S plus uh, structures and stuff so you have the risk of actually having your base just vanish so they were looking at fixes from it earlier and some of the fixes included the some of the s plus stuff possibly disappearing and, and server re-rows um, or rolling back rather to like a oh shit an earlier time so I think we're just going to wait it out and see what happens with it. Hopefully the owner or the uh, the mod author will fix it. But yeah, the, this last patch kind of actually broke quite a bit of stuff. You can't farm metal with the Anki and Quetz anymore. But that may have been intentional, I don't know. Um, there's a couple other things that are kind of borked right now. But that happens with every patch. So there'll probably be like eight patches in the next two days. The new Sabre model, though, looks pretty cool. I mean, it looks a lot better, in my opinion, than the old model. And it still could use a little bit of a work. But, hey, it's better than what it is. I'm glad to see they're finally going back and uh, giving the, the older dinosaurs some TLC. They made it a little better at farming pelt and stuff, so... I don't know how much that was needed. I think they need, really, an overhaul as far as damage and... Uh, utility. The raptors definitely need some love and some of the uh, other dinosaurs need some love like megalodons and stuff they're just they're useless at this point. Megalodons need like a bleed attack or something. Oh hello Garrett Giga what level are you? 90 or 63 Too bad, it's a nice color too, like reddish and black. Why does all the cool colored stuff like look like crap? Take those, take the extra spyglass. I need to give him back his uh his ramshackle thing. Land. Alright, now we in business. transparency on this no nope, other way All right, so watch when it closes it's opaque oh yeah there we go yeah this is my little cave it's kind of crowded in here now though <laughs> I don't think I've ever shown anybody or shown any any of this, but I got this Archaeopteryx today for the 196 female. Here's my monitor lizard. Did they ever fix this? I couldn't pull this thing up on the wall. Oh my goodness, so much collision with tails. 
see if they fix this. There we go. Yes. I love these things. You just drop off. And it stays up there. So you can just use them as decorations. They're kind of useless for the most part, but they're just fun to have. I think, yeah, I still got the feed and trough. Do you not know about them? I need to tame another one. I need to get a mail. But yeah, I love them. And then here's my two RGs. Here's my packs of Allosaurus. I got three Waverns now. There's Thor, my highest level one. There's Tesla, my female. Yeah, you can climb ceilings. You can climb anything with them. They're, they're freaking awesome. At least from that standpoint of, you know, being what they are. This ain't any stamina. Uh, let's see, what else do I have in here? Yeah, here's a 266 poison waiver and egg if you want that. I'm, I'm not going to use it. I'm not a big fan of the Poison Wavens, but it's max level. I'll show you where I'm going to move. Put this in there. Yeah, I thought I had a blueprint for that. Seeing what I got right now as far as stuff. Let's put that in there. Let's put this extra spyglass in there. Okay. Yeah, I don't... I just found it in there and I was like, well, it's a max level. Somebody might want it. At least just for a waiver, and at least. Let's see what all I got in here. I got a couple spines. Oh, sorry, screw it. Alright, let's go take Thor. Let's go kill that Giga that's out there, that lower level one. I should still have plenty of meat. Yeah, I do. Let's fill up our water jars. Land, 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 land. We're not going to kill that one because I might tame that one. That was a 126 male black. Let's get our fill on water. But we will go over there and kill this lower level one. And then I'll run over to the Red Redwoods area. And show the area that I'm going to build in. Or at, rather. Okay, go where you at. Just tingles. Uh, I hate Wayburns how badly they turn. Stop moving. Light your ass up. Even with a 60, whatever this is, it still takes a minute for it to die. I just do not want it to get me. Now I gotta get some stamina. Why aren't I sleeping? Because tonight is really the only night I can stay up late. It's 2.30 a.m. here, so... Y'all do it all the time. I don't want to hear nothing. Y'all stay up to like 5 and 6 a.m. or just pull all-nighters. Moving. 
stay there. That's perfect. No, nope. don't move. Stay there and get blasted. Stay there and get fucked up. Some more. Yeah, basically, fried giga. How do you want it? Making that giga bacon. Saints got to be freaking dead. There we go. And we got a level. Sweet. Nope, I got a level. Ah. I'm at 86. Let's see if this, these things never drop anything either. And it's bullcrap that it's like the biggest predator and it doesn't drop shit. Like they're even more dangerous than freaking alphas. And it drops. Train arrows. Hold on. I will take that. Give me that giga heart. Faster. Yeah, they don't give anything though. It kind of sucks. Wait, are you the same one? Nope, it's another one that just spawned. It literally just spawned there. I ain't messing with it. Screw it. There's another one over here. Yep, there it is. There, I think it's either a male or female. Female. Yeah, it's all black with gray. Yeah, that's one reason why I had to put up that metal gate. Because I didn't want them getting in there accidentally and just killing all my shit. But I will be moving whenever S Plus gets updated or fixed. And we'll be moving to a giga, a gigaless gigaless location. Now you first, Suffering. You first. Eat that bitch. Well, see, I've been kind of hoping they would put Platforms Plus in here. Because Platform Plus lets you make a um, treehouse, basically. And you can snap structures to it. With the existing platforms, you can't snap anything to it. So, you basically, you can't have a tree form or a treehouse space. So, it kind of sucks. But, yeah, if, if we get Platforms Plus, then... I'll definitely be building like a treehouse uh, base, like right there or on that one or over on this bigger one. Yeah. But yeah, this would be like the uh, over here, over on those two spots is where I'm gonna build. But this right here, this could be my little area for my flyers because nothing can get to them up here. There's no argents or anything up here. I could park them here, I can park them down there, I can put some plat or I can put some foundations and ceilings and spread it out. Um, here where I put these foundations, these are nice and flat areas. I can put my bases here and have it extend over there. Or if they allow us to do the platforms plus, I can put the platforms right there and put one there and put one over there or wherever and just connect them. And you have a nice little scenic spot right here overlooking this lake. Uh, you have the snow biome right there. Yeah, vanilla tree platforms suck. 
I'm not sure what the hell is going on with them, but and back over there where I was, the Scotland area, there's a cave there that has stalactites in it that you can put the tree platforms there too. So I can make a water base out of that because I actually have two of my megalodons stored over there. But yeah, this is where I would build whenever they get the S plus uh, crap situated. So I'm going to run over here to Green Obelisk and find this Titanosaur. Uh, not Andre. Well, I'm not sure what you put. I don't feel like checking it. So just no caps, man. I'll be glad when they update the map though, and they release the rest of it. See, I've looked at the. Yep, and I'm gonna ban your ass on this one too. See ya. Anyways, um. Shit, this is through the murder snow. This is going to hurt. Yeah, there's... Uh, I looked at the underwater compartments that actually is an S+. Plus, and... They take freaking tech element. That sucks. Yeah, not dealing with the trolls tonight. Yeah, you gotta have element for the underwater compartments, which I was kind of disappointed in. I was hoping that you wouldn't. But, it's like, whatever. Yeah, there's so much still. I haven't... Viper said there's a way to get behind the, the wall. I haven't seen it. Or I haven't been behind the this wall right here. But, I mean, from what it looks like, just from what you can see away from it, like through that wall, it looks pretty sweet. Especially over near the swamp area, um, like that area right there, it looks pretty cool. And there's a lot more islands and stuff out there. So I don't know, that may be a good place to build too, is also at where the islands are. We'll have to see what it looks like. Damn, that shit hurt. What is the temperature here? Negative 71, negative 72. It's freaking ridiculous. Negative 74. That's why they call it murder, murder snow. <laughs> Okay, well, go troll somebody else. I mean, are you really that bored with life that you have to come into somebody's stream and just troll? Alright, there it is. Yes. It wasn't just murder snow, it's murder, murder snow. Do you see that? Someone got creative with that name. Like, we're not going to call it just murder snow, it's murder, murder snow. I don't know if they just got lazy with it, or if it's just an inside joke, or what, but hey. Alright, let's kill this bastard. Stay still. Uh, my night is going pretty good. We got some stuff done. I got a 196 Quetzal. I made a behemoth gate for my little cave. And right now we're going to kill this Titanosaur. And try and get some more XP. Curious to see how long it takes. Yeah, it's like murder times X murder snow, hazardous to your health snow. I don't know. Hopefully they finish it though, so soon. One more time, I gotta level land. Right, let's go land. What level are you, Mr. Griffin? Stay still, 133. What the hell? 
hell's it doing? Serial, yeah, serial killer snow. Ted Bundy tundra. Let's go. So, there's no telling, man. Yeah, you're already bloody, aren't you? Get some more freaking. Take my electric glass. You love it. You want it. Show me them green numbers. Oh yeah, baby. I mean, I guess. Show me them lovely green numbers. Green looks so good on you. One more time, we'll get some more stamina. Getting fucked up. Getting there, getting the bloody. Come on, hurry up. I want you to die, sucker. Oops. <laughs> Collateral damage. Because it gives a ton of XP, Jim. Plus, why not? They just stomp around thinking they're big, tough motherfuckers. Well, guess what? You ain't so tough. Proud your ass. Get off my lawn. Land. Bye. Yeah, you better turn the other way, bitch. But guess what? I'm still coming for that ass. Get some. Oh, oh, Waylon, what are you doing? Stop spazzing out. Air brake. Per hit. Hey. Part of the food chain. His presence offends me. Get off my arc. Watch, it won't even drop nothing either. Like the biggest damn dinosaur in the freaking game, it won't drop shit. No, it's needed to kill. Because, see this? I need more of this. I need more of these. I need to hit the plus button. Are you gonna try to commit suicide? Coming for you. Where's Sally? About dead. What level is it anyways? Like level 7. See, it's so low level, it doesn't even deserve to be on here. I 
I'm just putting it out of its misery. See how bloody it is. <laughs> How many levels did it give me? It gave me five levels. It gave me a level two. Look at that. Heck yeah. All in melee. It gave me a level two. So, I mean, it gave me one level. Sally will always be remembered. I'm going to put that in health. I wonder if it gave me anything, though. I doubt it. I don't think it drops anything. Let's see. Big bastard. <laughs> Give me. Wow, I didn't drop nothing. What a complete waste. Hello, hi. What a complete waste. Wonder how much prime it gives. Chomp, 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 chomp. Oh my god. It gave me 129 prime. Holy crap. Definitely don't want that much. Oops. Transfer over some meat and then drop the rest. Hey, it gave a crap ton of prime. It lived a good life. It was just time for it to go. All right, let's see if we can find the Alphas. Level are you, 77. This would be actually a pretty cool area too to build in because it's nice and flat through here, but there's just not a whole lot to look or look at. So, damn it, poor wall. See all like all that area over there. That's that's gonna be cool looking if they finish it. All those little islands and stuff out there. I don't even think you can get to that one out there. I think it's blocked off. Yep. All those little islands, there's like there's that big island over there. You still have the desert area. There's a mod, or actually there's a couple mods that introduce actual tribes. And there's the tribes are in different areas of the game or the map. And they will straight up beat the shit out of you and stuff. Like some are, some tribes are stronger than others. It's pretty neat. They're, some of them are pretty broken, and they actually, they'll ride around on dinosaurs and stuff, too. Uh, certain tribes will tame certain dinosaurs. I forget what the mods are called, but... Like, some will only use clubs, and then, like, some of the other ones, like, there's, like, a black tribe that uses, like, freaking sniper rifles and spinosaurs and shit. It's ridiculous. So it's kind of, it's kind of like PvP in a way. You just missed it. We just killed the Titanosaur. Gave me five levels on my Waver and gave me an actual level to myself. What am I? Level 87. Damn it. Gave me actual level and a half. This is actually a pretty nice little area down here too, but it's just so far away from everything. So much nasty shit over here too. Yeah, there's actually two. Um, there's one that's called Murder Snow and Murder Murder Snow, which is like negative 70 to like negative 90 degrees. So you have to have like a crap ton of torpor and some really great uh, snow armor or else you won't survive. Your health drops so freaking quick, it's ridiculous. Um, but here's Tex and Doctor's bases. They're building like a little community here. And if you didn't know, where is it at? This is the metal cave. You actually have to knock this wall down. 
but I'll show it to y'all real quick. A lot of people don't know this is even here. Yep, this is the, the actual metal cave. So they've, they've hidden quite a bit of stuff on here. So you can knock out the rest of the wall, but there's a ton of metal in here. See all the metal through here? So you could come in here and farm all the metal. There's obsidian. I don't see a whole lot of like the rich metal nodes. There's a couple in here. I mean, there's quite a bit where you could bring an Icon and Kylo in here and farm it and leave it in there. And that wall um, will respawn, so you have to continuously re-break it. Yeah, it's a nice little area. Tex got it right there behind his house. And there's all kinds of ruins and stuff. I wish they did more with the ruins. Like some of the ruins have like the skulls and stuff in them. This is an amazing map, but I wish they had done a little bit more with it. I don't, they may still do some more with it. Like all the ruins and stuff right there. But over here, there's just so much nasty stuff. Like usually there's Rexes, there's Carnos, there's Allosaurus, like there's a Rex right there. There's Argents everywhere. Uh, we've seen Alpha Rexes spawn over here. Uh, Doctor's Gaming's house is over here somewhere. There's a fairy. And then Joey's house, who we haven't seen in freaking forever, uh, is over here too. Moody's house is over here somewhere. He's in a cave now. He's got himself a nice little house. Yeah, here's, uh, here's Doctor's Gaming's house. Looks like he's built on quite a bit. He's got him an ice waver and griffin. Stuff. I think Joey's house is further down. I think somebody built like a little taming pen or something. I'm not sure what they tamed down there, but there's another one out there. I think maybe is that or somebody's building out there. I'm not sure what this was. It looks like an altar. You can see like the rows of seats and stuff. And these little crates you find, you can break them open with a pickaxe and they have like primitive stuff in there like primitive crossbows, prim uh, picks, pikes. Um, so they're actually very valuable during the early game. Yeah, Joey's little hut thing is right here. Joey being Redbeard's Adventure. I can see an alpha or something around here. I don't see anything. We'll head back over to the castle area. Yeah, there's so much cool shit on this map. Here's a ruined bridge. And usually there's a bunch of nasty stuff up here. I've seen aloes, carnos, there's a rex right there. What level is a rex? 119. Uh, when we first started, there was like a 203 Megalosaur sleeping there. I don't know if there's any more. Let's go up here in the winter biome. I'm going to check the chest, see if it's respawned. Waterfalls. I mean, some of the waterfalls and stuff in here are gorgeous. But, again, there's so much nasty stuff around it. Or dangerous stuff that, man, it's just hazardous but yeah this map is gorgeous and Moody had built over here but he abandoned this area um, he doesn't live there anymore I don't know where the cave is that he moved to but yeah this is the start of uh, one of the winter biomes now this winter biome is actually you can live here without much trouble. I mean, it does get cold here, but nowhere near as cold as... Oh shit, there's a red drop. Um, nowhere near as bad as the other one. Let's run over here and grab this red drop real quick. 
Hopefully I can get to it in time. Looks like prison. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could call it Alcatraz. I mean, there's literally nothing around it. It's kind of why he moved, because there was nothing around it that you could store dinos on. It was cool, though. Actually, I think there's a, there's a chest or something at the very bottom of it, because you can swim down. Um, and there's multiple layers that go down in that little temple thing. I could never go down deep enough to see what was there. How much time's left on this thing? Come on, show me. Is it still there? Shit, it's still dropping. Oh yeah, we got plenty of time. We'll come back here in a minute. Let's run over here and grab this chest. Now, if none of y'all know where this chest is, I'll show you. It's fairly easy to find. And I think it respawns either every 30 minutes or every hour. But it may be every 30 minutes. It responds pretty quick. Whatever the case may be. There's also, uh, this is also where you can find some of the ice waver nest. And then in addition, of course, the eggs. Now, we haven't had an ice waver spawn in a while. So I don't know if there's any nest over here right now or not. But we'll check it after we get this chest. And I think the chest, yep, the chest is there. So right here in this cave, there's this little treasure chest. Looks like a note chest. I'm sure you've seen them on the island or whatever map. So this right here, you have to be level 80 to get. And it is the same. Oh, sweet. Ascendant fur cap. So it is the same as a red drop in a cave. Um, you can get some really nice stuff in it, but I don't think it's been updated with the new stuff. Um, it does not have like any of the newer saddles or anything like some like the the item drops do now. It only has stuff from uh, from previous stuff. But yeah, here's some of the wavering nests. Like they'll be around here. I don't see one up here now. I haven't seen one in a while. Uh, is that a nest? No, I think it's an owl. That's an owl thing. It's a helpful wolf. Um, but yeah, like around that area, there will be the ice waver nest. I don't haven't seen an ice waver in a long time. So, yeah, and around here, you'll see the ice waver nest. But yep, that'll be nice. It's got me an ascendant freaking fur cap. What was the armor on it? 147. Sweet, look at that. 177 insulation, too. So, yeah, it's good to check that... Th if you're high enough level, it's good to check that at least every 30 minutes or so. I've gotten a lot of good, nice stuff out of it. I've gotten Ascendant Saddle Blueprints. I've gotten Ascendant Pre-Made Saddles. I've gotten... I'm hungry. Um, what else have I gotten? I don't know. I've gotten, you know, quite a bit of nice stuff. It's basically a red drop guaranteed or a red... A red uh, cave drop every 30 minutes so why not and it's always had something like either an armor blueprint a saddle blueprint or like a weapon blueprint I've never found stupid shit in it like a water jar or any stupid shit like that so what do you got for me and you have nothing shitty ass drop. Okay, what was I going to do? I'm going to go over here and look and see what is over here. Let's see if I can find that 210 Rex. We may just go ahead and knock it out. Kill some of these aloes down here, though. Come here, aloe. Yeah, get shit on. Fucking roasted. Oh, there's an alpha raptor. 
Let's see what level you are first. There's always like an alpha wrapped over here. 35. You ain't gonna give me shit probably, but you know what? Screw it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Wow. Seriously? What a horrible time for a freaking stupid micro raptor to come. Wow. Where did they go? Kill every freaking single one of y'all. Stupid bastards. Where'd y'all go? Oh, don't wanna go down there. I know they're down there somewhere. Yeah, the fucking micro raptors. I hate them. They just come out of nowhere. Really, there shouldn't even be any around here. But, you know, those stupid bastards just come out of nowhere. Watch, I'll probably get hit by them again. You're dead. Fuck off. Let's see what you gave me. You got anything good? Nope. An ascendant cloth hat. Oh my gosh. We freaking hit the jackpot. Nope. Piece of shit. This little shithead still over here. always come in like the worst times too. I don't know where the fuck they went. Well, that was a fix. It's, I'll tell you what level it is. It's get fucked up level. Let's go Rex. You want a piece? I don't care if you want a piece or not. I'm giving you the whole pie. Let's go. Yeah, get zapped. What else is down here? Let's freaking kill everything. Just feel murderous tonight. <laughs> Just kill everything in sight. Slow down, slow down. Shit, I gotta get stamina. I know you're happy. Fuck them up. Damn. See what else is around here. Time to clean house. You don't want none of this, Rex. Absolutely none. Where'd that Rex go? There's that 210. It's a male too. I want it. I don't want to kill it. Well, 
will fry your ass up, Mr. Rex. And I will fry your ass, Gallo. Just killing everything. Straight up like the murder snow. Brought to you live. Yeah, there are there are some underwater caves. Um, there's actually one underneath the the castle that leads out into a big open cavern that Viper went uh, splurging in and died pretty horribly because it has like, a crap ton of megalosaurus in it. But I haven't went down in one. We actually looked at it and then we got the hell out of there. Yeah, there's actually several underwater caves on this map. Can you just land? Instead of acting stupid, instead of going five miles out of the way, just land. There's no need for you to freaking go all the way over there. You can die too for hitting me with your tail, bitch. Okay, what level is this one? 77 and an aloe. Guess what? Y'all been inducted into the murder club. <laughs> yeah, just go nuts, baby. Go nuts. Flip out. Because you're dead. Who else? Who else wants to join the club? Oh, you're our next. Insufficient stamina. Fuck off. I don't need stamina. Land, land, land. You're seriously not coming after me, are you? Seriously? Get out of here. Dang, you got pop, son. Must be high level Diplo. What you be like 210 at 189? Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Oh my god, I hate these things. They're like fucking dry bys. Yeah, that's what you get, you pile of shit. Fucking assholes, dude. I hate them. They just attack you for no reason too. Like it's just they're basically just like a big giant middle finger. Why is my mouse all fucked up right now? Yeah, it, there's actually a couple entrances to it apparently. Um, there's one that leads out like over there. There's one that leads out over here underneath the water. So you can bring uh, water tames inside of it. My mouse is acting all stupid right now. Like it's not tracking right. Let's kill this one over here, not the 210 one, but this guy. Get away, don't want you to get hurt. Maybe I should come over there. There's one to just spawn. 133. Well, it was this gray one. It's 70. That thing should die pretty freaking easy then. And 
and you're dead. Welcome to the Fradrex Club. Okay, that great one's split up. Let's go kill it. Fry you, I'm just gonna bite your ass. Ah, what did I do? Oops. Not good, not good. I keep forgetting I do that. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Shit. Hopefully nothing comes and gets me. Rex, you need to stay over there. Shit. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. If you ever need to get your wavering, that's the best thing to do is to tell it to land there. Okay. See you later, Jim. Thanks for stopping by. I'm not going to stream too much longer, though. I'm going to go to bed here in a little bit. See if anything worth a crap spawn, no. Maybe another Alpha Raptor? Who knows? drink. I'm getting thirsty. All right, we're back. What's up, Zeon? Yeah, here's the the ship that Viper is up here building. I don't know exactly what it's supposed to be. If it's like supposed to be like an arc or what, but I haven't actually seen it. We'll go ahead and take a look at it real quick. See what all he's done. You going to follow? Nope. Good. Is there a way to get it back up here? If I do get off, maybe. Yeah, good, there's steps. But yeah, I haven't seen it. He's been busy on this thing for quite a while. It's going to be massive, though. Looks pretty cool. Oh, here we go. Broodmother. I love these little terrariums. Sweet, thank you, Judge. I didn't get a notification though, man. If you actually subscribe, you may have it set to private, so I wouldn't see it. So if you want to see the subscriber um, notification, you can unhide yourself and then unsubscribe and resubscribe to see the notification. But it didn't pop for me though, buddy. What the hell was that? No, I was like, what the hell? 
You're getting fucked up, Dillo. Yeah, we're just looking at the aquariums right now. I wish they had one for the Megalodon, but they don't. Happy birthday, Nick. Here's the wavering one. See, this one's pretty cool because you can see so much detail. Look, they actually knocked out a trike entertainment. It. Cooking stuff. You have your sheep. You have your lightning waverings. And what's weird is that... So on this, that is a hatched fire egg. You have your bear. I thought there was something else in here. Maybe, maybe not. I swear there was like a truodon or something in this one. I can't see it though. But yeah, you have your your bees. You have your snail. You have your honey. Another one. Really cool. You have your quetzal one. It's got a salmon. What's it fighting? Has it got the new model? Yeah, it does. That's cool. It's got the new model. It's got a Kentro. Mike Hunt. What's up? And if you're wondering what these are, these are part of the Echo uh, mods. I think this one is the Echo Terrariums. I haven't seen this one. This is, must be the Broodmother. It's got the Bat. Spiders. Arthopleura. Haven't seen this one either. This is the Scorched Earth one. Mammoth. Wolves. Oh, you're fucked up, Mammoth. Sneak one of them. Got a Capro. Bullfrog. There's the Diplocollis. It's a Dimetrodon. What was in this one? Oh, this is the beaver one. Got an Archer Optrix. Beaver. There's a Truodon. I knew there was a Truodon in here somewhere. Those fuckers. Heat them things. They got a Mosasaur. A Lepluridon. Now, I don't know about y'all, but that looks stupid. It's like the little dangly thing on it. They have too many bear ones, in my opinion. Okay. Okay, whatever, dude. What's he got down here already? See, he already got the shit. Oh, he's got his beetles. This is pretty cool. I mean, it, Look at all the stone. This thing must have took an enormous amount of fucking stone to make. It's cool though. It's like very basically like a Noah's Ark thing. He must have looked off something to build this. But yeah, I mean it's going to have a ton of storage and stuff for dinos. That is a definite. Let's look in the greenhouse real quick. It's got his little greenhouse going on. Let's go ahead and get some water. Yeah, the, that's basically what they made. It was the magical Lepluridon from Charlie's. It'd be funny if they actually made it to where you had to tame it with like a liver from something that dropped a liver. Or like a kidney or something. Whatever it was that they stole from him in the one episode. That would have made it even better. Okay, let's see if there's anything nasty to spawn now. Doesn't look like it. What's up, Tropical? I know for some of y'all it's probably just starting out the day, but it's like 3.30 a.m. here for me. I'm 
going to run up here and grab this drop. I can't tell from here because it's so bright if it's yellow or if it's white. We'll go check it, though, while we're up here. I don't think the drop, the treasure chest, would have spawned again already, but we'll check it, too, just to make sure. And then we're going to go down into the Wavering Gorge and see if there's any high-level eggs. Now, I still would like to get a high-level fire. Uh, my lightning was 252 when I found it, but I would like to find a 266 or a 259 fire. Just to have one. Fire is my favorite, even though the lightning is better, but hey, I love the way the fire waverns look. I found a 266 uh, poison wavern. I don't want that, and I don't want that um, egg, but man, it, I hate the poison waverns, and we're not doing PvP, so it's just a real waste. It looks like it has not spawned yet, so. Alright, let's go see if there's any high level eggs. First, I'm going to stop over here. What the hell's going on with all the Archies over here? Uh, I'm going to stop over here at our little pin that we built over here in the canyon. I'm going to stop and make sure that my T Rex and my two U Tyrannus are fine. Yeah, I love the way the fires look. They look like a typical dragon. I'm really disappointed in the Ice Waverns. I thought that they would actually have a better model rather than just a reskin of the, the Lightning Waverns. And it would have been better if they would actually have like an Ice Beam like the Lightning Waverns do, but yeah, whatever. Uh, I forgot I don't have a saddle for this one. But yeah, I tamed, this, I tamed these two the other day. They basically look exactly the same, but they these have been like the only two high-level um, Uteranus that I've seen like in any of the servers that we played on I'm trying to think this one was a 203 and i think this one was like a 182 so i already have an egg from them when can i breed them again well i can breed them now i think yep sweet i can breed them again and this was a 203 female rex i need to find a male for and there's a, there was that 210 male down there that i would like to get and tame i don't know if i'm gonna get it tonight may wait but we'll eventually get her a, a buddy. Yeah, they're basically just big fuzzy chicken. Let's see, were there any drops that I can grab real quick? I don't think so. Doesn't look like it. All right, why are we so heavy? What the hell do I have on me that's so freaking heavy? All right, let's go drop this shit off real quick. Just, I'm not going, is it, yeah, I'm not even going to try to say your last name, homie. Sorry. I forgot what I have in here. I have some stuff in here, too. What do I have? Yeah, look at all this shit I got in here. I got a blueprint for that. I found, see, this, this guarantee, or this shows that some of the new saddles are dropping. So here's a Uterana saddle that I found the other day. Oh, I do have a damn Quet saddle blueprint. Um, see what else is... I found this in... This is what I found in that... that uh, The chest up there. Up in the winter biome. So I found this. I found this. 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 Found... No, I did not find that. Um, I think that's it for that. Need to put this in there. What else? Go with that. I'll drop a bunch of the shit here in a minute. Get rid of that. Okay, to pull some meat over there and we drop everything else. Actually, we'll, actually we don't need the Alice or brain either. We should be light. There we go. All right, let's go find some wavering eggs. See if we can find my fire wavering. I'm not gonna worry about. There's a drop over there. I'm not gonna worry about. We can come back and get it after we run through and look at the uh, the wavering eggs. Yeah, I mean, there's if you're high enough level, check it. Definitely check it. 
especially if you're on like, like a low pop server it's definitely worth checking it's, like I said it's basically a guaranteed red drop I'm gonna kill y'all just so it respawns you rot. There was another one over here. I don't know where the, the other aloe is, but screw it. And normally when I go over to the Wavering Cave, I like starting from the bottom and then going up to the top, like where it leads out up here, but since we're flying over here, we'll just start from there. But over here, you gotta watch because a lot of the times that the uh, the nest, you can find nests that are hidden in like the the nooks and crannies and some of the walkways that go across the the wavering crag over here, they'll have nests in them too. But you definitely gotta be careful in here because I've seen where some of the waverings will actually get stuck or spawn inside of the wall where the nest is, so they can still attack you and do the breath attack through the walls of the actual crag. So you definitely got to be careful. So here's a nest right here. What's in here? It's a lightning. Let's see. Looks like there's a nest down there too. Let's try and pull some of these out real quick. It's just spot. And see, they can get hurt by the actual... by the lava too. Let's pull some of these out. I should have quite a few of them aggroed. Yep, I got a lot of them. Okay, we'll just lose them. But you always want to make sure you take them up to the sky. So that way they despawn. So now I can outrun them. You see, they'll all follow me, and they've already started. Yeah, they've already all oh, de-aggroed. So now I can fly back down in here and get the eggs, and not have to worry about anybody. If the eggs aren't high enough level, though, I'll leave them for now. We'll clear it out at a later time. Usually at least once a week we'll clear out the, the nest down here of all the low level ones. But I'm not going to worry about doing that right now. We're just going to check most of the, the nest. We'll check the lightning and we'll check the uh, the fire wavering eggs. But we're not going to mess with the poison. I hate the poison ones. But there was a nest down here. Let's go down here and check it. Poison? Nope. Come on it. Piss off. What level were you? We won't mess with the low level ones. Oh. Ouch. Yeah, you can't hurt me. I'm lightning too, bitch. Normally I would, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. Like I said, at least once a week. Oh, hello there, lag. Uh, once a week we go through and we eat them all. All the low level ones so we can get new eggs in. But I'm just going to go through it tonight and try and find the high level one. I'm not going to fool with clearing them out tonight. What were you? 
lightning too. Let's check you. all the lightning eggs tonight. Yeah, I know you're on fire, but you're fine. You'll live. Twenty-one. Man, what's with all the low level ones? What's spazzing out? I don't know if it's me or not, but it looks like the, the eggs glow more. 28. Damn it. There's another fire one. Land. Land for me. Land. There we go. Let's run up and check this one real quick, and then we'll check the lightning. 21. What the shit, man? Come on. 20. Wow, what is going on? Why are they all low level? Hmm. Yeah, see, like in these walkways, you'll have you need to check it because sometimes they'll have nests in there too. Yeah, it looks like they've gotten brighter. I don't know if it's me or not, but it looks like they've definitely increased like the, the glow that they give off. Oh shit, the one to him. So what level is he? He's a low level, we'll kill him. Yeah, he's 126. I don't want to mess with him right now. Run over and see if I can check that lightning without a without aggro on him. It's gonna be sketchy. Yeah. Now you're gonna die, buddy. You shouldn't have came in here. You came in the wrong hope. Come on back in here. Let's see. I'm not in here with you. You're in here with me, you bitch. 20. What the fuck is going on? Why is there nothing but this, like, low level bullshit? Low level. Is there anything in this egg? Yeah. I'll just be, like, 28 and shit, too. Land. Land for me. Back it up. Please don't move. Oh, hello. Yep, we're getting out of here. I will get that. I will get that. <laughs> Did the alpha, the alpha didn't even aggro on me. I'm hoping that it doesn't disappear though. Do I still have it? Yes, good. Because sometimes if the egg is sitting there for a while, it'll actually spoil, but it'll still be there for you to pick up. I'm surprised the alpha didn't come after me. But all right, we got to, we got us a nice high level 238 fire waver now. We'll hatch it out um, next week. Next, I'll take it back over to the castle and put it in that nest so that way you can get to the 1%. As soon as I get out of it, can, yep, okay, so we should be good now. I should have de aggroed. Sweet, I'll go ahead and run this back down to my cave, put it in the box, and I'll have a nice, decent 
level fire wave right now. 238 is definitely respectable. Be nice if I could find even in higher or even a higher level one, but hey, beggars definitely cannot be choosers. Anything that level or above, I'll take. At some point, I would like to get that Giga, and there's another one back there I would like to get, because they're male and female. But yeah, I'm going to run into my little base. My little cave base, and we'll stick this in there. Actually, I need to move Tartarus closer, so that way he can eat out of the trough. room in here. Yep. See, I still got wavering milk, too. Another eight days. What's going on, Amoni? We're just out hunting some wavering eggs. Seeing what we can find. I got my gate built for my little cave, so the gigas can't get in there and chomp away at my stuff. We're going to head down into the bottom part now. All the high level eggs I've found have been in the bottom part, so fingers crossed. And here's the wavering trap that I built to get us milk and stuff. Need to modify it a little bit because it hasn't been working that well, but basically you leave the wavering in there and they get trapped in there and then they can't turn back out around. It's worked pretty well so far. I mean, it could be better, but hey, for what it is, it's definitely done its job. All right, let's see what's down in here. Nothing there. Oh, there is an egg there. I've always had good luck coming down here and finding some high level eggs. This is where I found Thor's egg at. Let's see what level you are. 28. I don't know what is up with some of these low level eggs tonight though. Sometimes there's a nest back in here. Not tonight though. Kind of hard to see in here though with it being so bright and stuff. There's a nest. What's in there? Poison. Don't want you. Don't want poison. Anything in there? Nope. There's a nest. What do you have for me? Looks like you're a poison. Yep, poison piss on you, don't want you. I wish you could just eat the eggs on the wavering. You're kind of morbid, but hey. Is that a nest up there? Yep. Come on, give me a high level fire. 266, baby, come on. Come to pop up, 21. Shit. level garbage and I think that's all the nest down here yep damn it well at least we got that one uh, let's go check the uh, the winter drop again see if it's spawned back I definitely need to get another lizard to have a mate for my uh, my female any drops or anything? Let's see anything yet. Looks like I'm about to level up. Yep. I'll hit 89. No, 88 here in a minute. Alright, guys, I got about 20 more minutes and I'm going to call the stream. It's 340 here, so. But I appreciate everyone watching and, and hanging out. 
We've gotten quite a bit done tonight. We killed a titanosaur. We got a couple of levels on our, our wavering. See, I'm, I don't really like the way they look, Judge. And I got a 266 a, or a 266 poison wavering egg. I just don't like them. I mean, they're great for PvP because they hit the rider. But I just don't like the way they look. And to be honest, I don't really like the way the, the lightnings look. Like for the head, I have they have like the little fin looking things. I don't like the way they look. I love the way the fires look. The fires are my favorite. But the lightning is just so damn powerful. Plus the poison, their attack is just a pain in the ass to try and uh, aim with it. Their damage just doesn't scale as much as the lightnings or the fires. So. And I prefer the Waverns over the Griffins. I know the Waverns can do a ton more damage, but I just prefer the, the Waverns. I just feel more comfortable with them. They, they, I feel like they tend to have a lot more um, to offer. I know they don't have as much health, but their damage output without having to do the die bomb constantly is just nuts, especially the lightnings. But let's go see if this uh, the treasure chest has respawned, hopefully. Those of you just joining, there, there's a treasure chest up here in the winter biome, right here by the starter area, that if you're level 80, definitely check it out. Um, I think it respawns every 30 minutes to an hour. I don't know, is it back? Yep. So the treasure chest up here, it's hard to, it's easy to miss because it's so small, but it looks like the, uh, the Explorer Note chest. And it's right here, and I'll give you the, the GPS for it. So the chest is at 33.36. For those of you who don't know where it's at. But the chest, it's a red drop. A red cave drop. I don't want those. But it always has something decent in it. Definitely check it out. Let's run down here and get the yellow drop. Yeah, we got oil rigs up here. What level are you? 77. You know, for this place being like the starter area, this is like an absolute nightmare of a place to start out at. Uh, you have the sea scorpions coming up on land now. You have rexes. You have carnos. You have argents. You have sabers. You have all kinds of nasty shit that spawns over here. I don't know why in the world uh, that they would recommend you starting over here. But yeah, this is where we originally started. Um, Viper built that as a base, but then he converted it to a taming pen. This little place right here, this was our community base, and then it looks like uh, someone's taken it and built it out into a compound now. That's Carnage's compound over there. He has like a shit ton of stuff over there. Let's go over and check this yellow drop. See if it has anything good for us. Does it have the ring around it? I do not know. There's a Rex back here. I ain't worried about it. What do you got for me? I'll take that. Why can't I get it? That was weird. Freaking lag. Rex. 28. Yeah, there's an absolute crap ton of pegos over there, too. For all of y'all. A 
hate pegos. Pegos and the stupid ass seagulls. I hate the most. Piper said he had some type of chest up here already. Let's go over and see what it was. How much XP do I need? I don't need that much. Let's go up here and go on the killing spree again. Try and level up real quick before we log off for tonight. Maybe there's another Alpha Raptor or something up here. There's been a whole lot of stuff that's respawned up here. At least predator wise. Still an absolute crap ton of raptors. Yep. All die. Other drops coming down. I already got that one. So is there no other Rexes? And so usually there's like a crap ton of Rexes up here. Doesn't look like there's been a whole lot of stuff that spawned. Hmm. Yeah, it's like, and they always get you at the most inopportune times. Like either when you're trying to tame something or or you're fighting something else, they just come up and they mob you. And they'll be always like a pack of them. They'll start stealing your fucking meat, your arrows, your freaking weapons, and spyglasses and shit. Like, they just freaking gang raped the shit out of you. And then it's like, well, which one do you go and kill to get all your shit back? There we go, we got our level. 88. Alright, let's go over to the castle real quick. Lag, lag, lag. Shit, dear. Oh yeah, uh, I found this also in the uh, that drop part over there. Give you some weight. Just give you some more weight, and then some health. She's got some levels. We got one. Put you in melee. Okay, yeah, here's some more stuff in the Senate scuba tank. We got some riot, uh, killing mask. I got a gas mask out of there one day. I got that Carno saddle. This was nice to find. Let's see. He said he had something in here. <laughs> That's what you call hot yoga. Okay, what did he have? Oh, he had a journeyman flag. Do I not have enough ingots? Surely. Why is I not pulling the ingots from for from the chest thing? Huh. That's weird. Yeah, it's for some reason it's not pulling the ingots. That's weird. I guess because it's not S plus, it won't pull the ingot. I guess it has to be S plus. Oh well.
We'll upgrade our chest. Birthday suit on there. There we go, boys. Now we got a nice chest piece. And again, thanks for everybody watching. Grab this green job. Sometimes they have narc arrows and stuff in it. It's always worth it. Okay, got some narcotics. All this shit I'm not gonna worry about though. Not the S Plus version, so I don't want it because you can't pick it back up. There's our 210. He's red, or his white was a red smell. So I'll keep him down there. It'd take about an hour or so to knock him out. Now, actually, how long would it take to tame him? Let's look real quick. It would take an hour and 33 minutes to tame that Rex right now. So, yeah, I'm definitely not fucking with him right now. That's just too long. Especially with the stream ending here in a little bit. I'm tired. It's almost 4 a.m. here. Let's fly back over to our base. We'll leave the Quetzal there for now. Should have brought that egg over here and put it in the hatchery, but oh well. Well, definitely been a successful night. We got that, we got our 196 Quetzal, which is back there at the castle. Um, it's got over 4,000 weight now. We found our base location that we're going to build at once S Plus gets fixed. We killed a Titanosaur. We've killed a Giga to get some sweet, sweet XP. We've gotten, what, three levels today just for ourselves. We've gotten multiple levels for our Wavering. we got a crap ton of levels for our Quetzal. Uh, we found a new hatchet. We got a, a decent level Fire Wavering Egg. We tamed an Archer, a 196 Archer while we were waiting for the Quetzal. It's a pretty, pretty successful day. Yeah, we've gotten some good loot too along the way. We got that fur cap, that ascendant fur cap that I found earlier. I wouldn't mind finding like a fabricated sniper rifle, ascendant one or like a master craft. But yeah, definitely in the next couple of days, I need to get another uh, monitor lizard tamed up. Have a mate boosted. Just to have. I love that you can cling from the roof with them. You can just uh, walk on the walls of the roof and leave them there. Definitely don't take up space. If you don't know where to find them at, right over here, starting where the, the trees are and stuff, right here by the volcano, the monitor lizards spawn right there on the beach, and they spawn up here. So there's one right there. 28. Now, they don't do a ton of damage for whatever reason in the wild and the stuff that they attack they don't 
It's like they don't get hurt by it. I don't know what's going on with them at this point. There's a 182. See how the parasaurs getting attacked, but it's like, it's like, who cares? Like, I don't even care. There's a 210 female. Which I don't need. I already have a female. I need a high level male. I would like it to be like black, purple, or something. 28. A 196 male. Black and purple. That'd be a nice one to get. Yeah, out here they don't spawn in the caves. I mean, they probably do still. But there's a lot of stuff that doesn't spawn where it's supposed to. Like the mantises and stuff, how they're supposed to spawn in the desert. They spawn here in the volcano area. Yeah, see, there's one right there. So, and I don't, you can't get the death worm horns right now. You have to use the ice worm horns, or horns rather. Um, I don't know where they spawn at. Viper does. They spawn in one of the caves or something. But apparently they're a lot weaker than the death worms. And they drop the horns that you can use to tame the mantises with. But yeah, in this cave over here uh, is where we call home right now. And I'll swing by and I'll show y'all the water cave that, uh, that y'all may not know about. But let's stop and get us some stamina real quick. But there's an. Hello. What level is those arrows? 63, 28. I mean, that's pathetic. Why is it always like. Always the cool looking ones, they have their shit low levels. Just because it pisses me off, I'm gonna come up here and fry the shit out of y'all. Piss off. Bastards. Anyways, I'll show y'all where the water cave is. Come on, get it in gear. I know what your problem was. Look, all the cool looking ones I found are females. I can never find like a high level cool looking male. Okay, gets this rampaging around. That gig is still there to uh, either tomorrow or whenever I'm on next, I'm gonna try and knock it out and tame it. White? Yellow? What is that? Originally, I was going to try to uh, build a base up here by this lighthouse, but it just. I came in single player and it just was not going to work out. But, with that being said, down here where the stalactites and the wavering crag formations are, right below the lighthouse, there is a cave. And as you can see, the water leads right into it into this nice big open cave. Now if you see these stalactites, all three of the stalactites that hang from the ceiling you can put a tree platform on. Uh, the tree platform you can put almost near the water on that one. That one's down a little bit lower and that one's down a little bit lower. So if you use like platforms plus, you can link them together because you can snap shit to them. Fortunately the vanilla ones you can't snap anything to. Um, but this is a nice deep uh, little pond area, or pool area, that you can put your water tames in. And I'll go down and show you real quick just how deep it is. See, it's really nice and deep. So you could put plesiosaurs, you could put mosasaurs, your squids, whatever. And it should be deep enough to where you can bring stuff in. Yeah, you should be able to bring everything that you need into there, right there. I mean, even that, you can wall it off. Nothing's going to get to it anyway, sir. But it's really deep right here. 
The Ragnarok ocean is really sketchy. Like, you can't see shit out there. Oops. About to die. Not even paying attention. But yeah, it's sketchy. Sketchy with a capital freaking S. Because you can't see shit down in there. Good thing about the Highlands is that they're sheep galore. There's sheep freaking everywhere out here in the Highlands. Or what they call it Scotland. Are still good on food. Like I said, we'll take some meat off of the waiver and give to y'all. Some health. Give you some food. Give you some more health. And y'all should be good for a while. Hey, it's what we're here for, is to teach, learn together. There's another little cool little cave over here by the Redwoods. I'll show y'all real quick before I log off. It's not as great to store dinos in. That's, this is actually a really nice little area right here. It's nice and flat right here by the beach. Um, you still have to worry about gigas, though, coming down through here. But, I mean, you have plenty of space to build right here in this little beach. But uh, I'll run up here and show you all this real quick. This little cave up here in the Redwoods. You could store some dinos, but you're not going to be able to store, like, Rexes and stuff in here. And again, I'll show y'all where I'm going to be building that while we're over here. Let's go ahead and get some food. And this little stream right here. You see where I'm at? It's right here by the Red Obelisk. There's a stream that leads in here. And there's a cave. This cave has two entrances. The front and the back. So... You have this little area. So, I mean, you can store stuff here. What the hell is that? Well, I'll be damned. I did not even know that was there. So there's an artifact in there, too. <laughs> um, I don't know if you can chop that tree down. I doubt it. Still, with that being said, you can still store stuff in here. I mean, you can create platforms, or not platform, but, you know, foundation to run it through here. And then the cave leads out through here. So you could wall it off with just a regular dino gate. So there's that one. Uh, that tree that went through there, that fallen tree trunk, you can actually get inside that tree trunk, too. It's big enough like that one, you can go through it. But I'll run over here and show y'all where I'm going to build. And if you have your own server that you play on, you know, you can build there too. But there's a nice little lake right here. And this is going to be my spot. Right up here where these two flat spots are, where I have the foundation very laid. So, nice flat spot right here. See, it's it's pure flat. So you won't have any problem putting enough foundations, and you have a nice wide flat area. And then you have this one right here, which you can link up to it. You can knock those two rocks out, make a walkway over here to that, back it right up to that rock. Um, if you use the platforms plus and stuff, you can make the tree platforms through there and link them up to make even better cool looking base. And then down there you have some flat areas where you can uh, have your tames. It's chilling. And then up here you can put all your flyers. Uh, because nothing's literally going to get to them from there. Because there's no argents or anything else that flies around up here that's going to hurt them. And you can just build a bridge from there to there to get up here. So this is a nice little cove area where you can store all your flyers. Um, you even have a spot up here to where you can store them. And you can put foundations and stuff up here and 
you know, put ceilings out on them to make it even uh, wider and longer. Yep, so, I mean, nothing's going to get to them. There's not going to be any carnals or anything that spawns up there uh, as long as you put foundations up there. So, yeah, it's a nice little area. And going back over here and looking. Let's knock out this tree real quick. Actually get an idea. And this is what it looks like. So you have a nice little scenic area with waterfalls leading into the lake. And looking at the map. So you're there. And don't look at the home thing, but you're right there. And if you look at the GPS, this is the coordinate toward. So if y'all want to look, come here yourself. But yeah. But yeah, you got that entire map, the bottom half of the map still left to go. And you're in a good spot to go to it, so. Yeah, right on the barrier. The barrier is literally like right over there. Now, it's a bitch to get through through the murder snow. Um, but really, once the, the map gets updated, you won't have the murder snow. Because you'll be able to go around it through the, uh, I guess, the archipelago or whatever. Yeah, the California Redwoods. But once the map gets updated, you'll be able to just go through this area to get around the murder snow. And there's also a nice little lake over here, but it's just not as scenic looking, I think. And there's not a whole lot more better area to, to build at. But yeah. You can go through here, and I don't know what course is going to end up happening with this part of the map, but hey. But yep, that's where I'm going to build. Is that right here where this little lake is? All right, I'm going to head back home, and we're going to call it for tonight. Time to go to bed. Appreciate everyone watching tonight. If you like what you saw feel free to stream or feel free, feel free to sub and then hit the little bell and get notified whenever I'm streaming next time I don't stream every week I try to um, I don't stream as often as other streamers but unfortunately I don't have as much time um, as other people do because we're we got a lot going on nowadays we're trying to build a house we're getting married in October uh, we just have a lot going on nowadays so Hopefully when we get the new house, though, I'll get my webcam set up. I'll have a webcam set up for my 250-gallon fish tank that I'll have separately as a fish cam. And then I'll get a green screen and stuff going on, and we'll be rocking and rolling with a new rig, too, so I'll build a, a new computer. So we'll be ready to go. But until then, I'll stream as much as I can, maybe once or twice a week. No promises, but hey. When I can stream, I will stream. Thank you, sir. We're going to fly back to our little cave, and we're going to call it. Definitely getting tired. Plus, I don't want to stay up too much later and then uh, sleep the whole entire day. Yep. Have a good one, Drex. While we're flying, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream, guys. Again, thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, feel free to uh, sub to the channel. Hit that like button. And see y'all next time. Peace.